you are most welcome to Spice Royal channel. Before we continue please remember to subscribe and hit the notification button for more updates. Following the stripping of titles off some royals in Europe Sweden was among, and that of King Carl Philip Payne the King the King of Sweden released a statement following response to interview saying, it has pained him deeply, King Carl XBI Gustav, the Swedish monarch, 76, admitted in an interview with SVT that he thought his son Prince Carl Philip was unfairly stripped of his crown prince title when Carl Philip was born in 1979, Sweden still had an agnatic order of succession meaning that only males could inherit the throne, so he was Sweden's crown prince, even though he had an older sister, Victoria, the king's eldest daughter, ended up becoming the crown princess, after legislation on full cognatic succession, was introduced in 1980, it's tricky to have laws that work retroactively, it doesn't seem wise, I still think so, yes, but it was my son, Prince Carl Philip he was born, and then all of a sudden you change, and, then he gets rid of it all, it's quite strange, I think, you can't do that the king said, asked if unfair, the monarch replied, yes, I think so the king went further to say during the autumn, on two interview occasions, I received questions about the change in the succession order in 1980, in favor of the firstborn child regardless of gender. I then shared my thoughts about Prince Carl Philip retroactively losing his position as crown prince in connection with the amendment to the constitution. It has pained me deeply when, in retrospect, I have heard comments that claim that I would not stand behind my daughter, Crown Princess Victoria, as Sweden's heir to the throne he continued. I therefore want to make it clear that my interview answers should not be interpreted as criticism of the female succession to the throne or of Crown Princess Victoria, the female succession to the throne is for me a matter of course, the Crown Princess is my successor the King called his firstborn Victoria an extraordinary asset to me, my family and our country he concluded, I am proud of her and her tireless work for Sweden, thanks for watching till the end, God bless you.